really, really scary last night. We have these giant trees. Hundreds and hundreds of old trees are huge in our backyard. I could just hear them whipping. Because I had trouble sleeping last night. My animals and the storm. And my belly full of crap that I ate this weekend. Although I was just looking. Not too bad in the grand scheme of things. <laughs> uh, one thing that's bad is that I'm up to 159.3, which sucks, you know. I don't want to see 160s ever again. And I was all the way down to 152.6. So, that sucks. <laughs> I'm up quite a bit from my low. But this weekend, I only gained had a huge increase Sunday morning which I wasn't surprised but I actually ate just about everything that I ate the day before again and I was only up 0 0.7 so that's pretty good for a weekend under four really when I used to like try to stick within a certain range I never wanted to gain more than six in a weekend so that's great. I don't know exactly. I'm at 150, basically 153. So I'm up 6.3 from my low, but really it's like probably almost 7 from my low. And I could, if I, if I played my cards right, did what I'm supposed to do today and tomorrow. There's the potential that I could get that off in a 72 if I was perfect. We shall see. I know I was, as I was eating yesterday, I had some taco dip and uh, some pulled pork. That's the only thing. I did eat pulled pork instead of like massive amounts of leftovers, but I had some jalapeno poppers, some Chick fil A nuggets, two street tacos. It is so wicked windy out here. Wow. And then when I couldn't sleep, like at 11.30, I had like a bunch of Tootsie Rolls. Um, some dots. <laughs> and an Almond Joy. So a bunch of candy. And that's, I, I, I was saying to my daughter, I was like, oh, this is going to make tomorrow's fast a lot harder when I was eating the taco dip. And I know it's going to, I know today is not going to, probably not going to go very well. It's going to be a tough. So I bought some new apple cinnamon, it was maple apple cinnamon or something, tea. And I do have quite a bit. I have to go to work now. I really was on the fence. I almost took today off. Excuse me. I, the only reason I didn't is because I have to go to the food bank and drop off donations. Then I have, which is on my way home from work. And I have to swing by and pick up Girl Scout money. Luckily our fall product sales are done now. So I can be done selling fall product. Although Maddie did excellent. Thank you for the ones that actually Eileen and David, you guys actually bought from her. It's crazy. Um, I appreciate it very much. She killed it. <laughs> she didn't do anything, but she just got like $900 in sales. It's like crazy. But I did buy a lot. I always buy for her fall product. I always buy her teacher gifts for Christmas. And even though we're virtual, I still want to send in something. So Girl Scouts have these tins during fall product that have like chocolate covered pretzels and stuff in them so I bought that for for all 10 of their teachers now that they have five teachers each so and another kid at their school got COVID so I'm, I'm glad they're still remote I'm still struggling with my son but first marking period ends next week while we're on vacation so at least it'll be fresh stars hopefully he will at least get C's kind of hoping he would do bees or better but we're gonna have to 
take a C at this point if I don't even know if that's considered passing. His school is so really, really extremely academically tough. So I don't even know if he gets a C if that's considered passing. I have to reach out to the school. Somebody told me they thought it was 80% or higher passes. During the spring, it was 80. You had to have an 85 or higher in order to pass the last marking period when we went remote. This is absolutely insane to me. It's like, we're going through all this and you're gonna make it even more difficult. But, and he has a, a very slight mild learning disability. So he has a 504 plan and he can retake and retake and retake. But as you can imagine, that's a lot of stress on me, like trying to set up retakes and making sure he's ready. It's just, it's a lot. I'm glad we're going on vacation next week. And though it, I wish I would have took some video of us playing with the puppies because they were so cute. I don't know why I didn't. Maddie was talking about them this morning. They were adorable. But I still don't really know. I don't really know how Derek feels about it. We didn't really get a chance to talk too much about it. He was feeling really, really tired and went and laid down. So I think he's a, you know, he's a softie on the inside once you really, like, peel back all the layers of the onion. So I think he kind of deep down loves it, but I don't know. We're def we're going to um, Florida on Sunday, so I don't want to... They luckily said they would keep it for me until after if we decided we wanted to buy it. But it was also a lot of money. So I, don't know. I don't know. I don't think about it. Unfortunately, I didn't do my gratitude last night. I thought about it. I did my dance workout and I had so many problems with the internet. I kept getting kicked off in the middle of the dance routine and that like sucks. So I went and did Wii Fitness. <laughs> I did like uh, hula hooping and uh, you carry this tray around, it's working on your balance, and what else? I did a couple of their fun little workouts. My girl was still fat on the Wii. Pissed me off. I was like seven pounds, eight pounds or something away from my goal on there. But I knew I would be way up. I would, you know, did it last night after eating and everything, so. But my plan today, it is freaking cold and windy, but at least it's sunny. That's so nice. Sun is so nice. Um, it's 45 right now and super windy. I'm hoping I'm going to look at the weather, but my goal is to go to the food bank and pick up Girl Scout money and make it home in time to do um, daughter's text of me. To be able to go for a run. I want to, I want to take Layla and I want to go for at least a mile walk and at least a mile run so I can get a couple miles logged in my challenge and get back on track. Um, like I said, I'd like to be doing a 72. I started last night, obviously, once I finally stopped eating. And really, I want to just go to Wednesday, so it would probably wouldn't be a 72. It would probably only be like a 60 or whatever, but... I would like to go in May, you know, I Do you see him? <laughs> He's in my lap. I went and picked up him today. We're gonna go see how he's doing at the house. So, I had to, um, I had to go do my food my food pantry donations and then I went and picked him up real quick then I had to go pick up money for Girl Scouts I brought him with me they loved him and now I'm headed home to surprise the kids they don't know so can you see him he's driving a car trying to be careful hi baby we're gonna call him diesel because he looks like he's got diesel oil all of Oh, he loves my Apple Watch. He loves to bite on it. He peed and pooped at the people's house. I was picking the Girl Scout money, so that's not good. 
it doesn't give me much vote of confidence that he um, is any type of house trained. I think he just goes whenever he has to go. It's a little worrisome. But other than that, I have a very good day. I, I've been perfect fasted. I did get a little sick. Um, I, I know I wrote it down in some one of my books, but I don't know where my book is right now because I'm driving. But I wrote down that I got nauseous and lightheaded and actually had some vision changes. And I was really afraid I was getting a migraine. And that sucks because that would have been very quick that, to get another one for me. But it could just be stress. I'm very stressed out with, yeah, so let's add a dog to the mix, right? But I'm very stressed out with Tate's school. It's been a lot of um, head headache for me. And get over it. In the slow lane, in the driving with a puppy lane. Um, I've been very stressed out with Tate's school. It's been so hard. We just are constantly redoing assignments and I'm just over it. I need a vacation. He needs a vacation. What's nice is um, the marking period ends on the 13th and while we're away and then we can reassess what's been going on with him because it's not working. I knew come in the springtime it wasn't working when they were remote, but I thought maybe when it was like everybody was doing it, it would be a little bit better. But it really hasn't. He just, he tries to get everything done quick so he can be done and then we have to redo it. And his school makes me submit like these resubmission forms because they don't know that a kid apparently resubmit something. So you have to basically let them know that something's being resubmitted. And Tate just, I don't know, he's a rusher. My daughter's doing so well, though, so. I guess it could be worse. I guess they could both be doing bad. He's driving a car. <laughs> it was kind of spur of the moment that I decided to go get him today. Like, I was gonna, I should have, like, planned it a little better. Maybe brought a little carrier or something, but how Layla did it too. We brought everything and she just cried the whole time so I had to hold her. He's loving me already very much. Just, I'm a little worried he's going to pee all over the house. You know, why do animals throw up and pee and poop on rugs? Even if the whole house is hardwood, they'll find the one throw rug and they'll do that. And I don't have any food for him. No, we're going to probably have to figure out what to do about that. Um, but exciting. Puppies are exciting, right? I would show you better, but it's being really good right now. Want to say hi to everybody? Want to come up here? A little bit more? Say hi. He likes it down there. Say hi. Cold. Like he's so little, he's got such little amount of fat on him that we got to get him a little coat, I think. But I don't know. So it's almost dark. It's five o'clock, so that means no running again, which totally sucks. <laughs> um, but I should be fine. I'll get to run tomorrow. I'm off for election day. Go vote. By the time you see this, it, it won't be election day. Sorry, but yeah, it will be election day. So go vote. Yeah, it's time to go vote. Um, but I have to go see my neurologist and vote. And Tate's taking a makeup test. And he's going to do a basketball clinic for two hours. But I am going to run. Maybe I'll run while he's at the basketball clinic. That sounds like a good plan to me. And my girlfriend who's going through a divorce is really having a hard time, so I'm going to check on her. I'm going to get some type of workout in. I sure do wish I had a treadmill. Maybe I should join a gym. 
hard to run outside sometimes. Now it's like 40 degrees. So that would be cold anyways. And I couldn't take this puppy. He would be way too cold. Layla could handle it, but she's got some meat. But I'll um, work out. I will try to check in and do gratitude. It's been two days, no gratitude. So I will check in in a bit with um, my workout. And then I will try to take a shower because I never did and get back on here tonight.
puppies here. It's been a crazy day. And I couldn't walk or run again, which totally blows. I really need to tomorrow. That's the plan. Maddie doesn't have ballet because of election day. So I definitely should have some time to myself. Maybe try to take this little puppy for a walk too, so he can learn. I just did my cardio, ended up doing dance. I got the Just Dance to work. And what else? I feel much better than I did earlier. Come Stripe. He's not too sure about the pup. I'll put the pup, lots of videos of the puppy on here too. Um, we're gonna call him Diesel, did I tell you that? Because he looks like he's got oil all over his back because he's brindle. A fast went pretty good today, I was so busy. Just not feeling very good. I didn't write down what time it was. I was thinking that maybe it was a migraine or maybe I was just dropping fluid too quickly. Maybe, don't know. But I feel pretty good. I'm glad I got some things done. I went and got the Girl Scout money and dropped off the donation. So I love checking stuff off my list. I need to shower and wash my hair because I haven't since I got it cut, which was Friday and today is Monday. So that's gross. I was only up 0.7 today, which was excellent. Overall, 3.8 for the weekend, which not bad, but 159.3, which is just way too close for 160. So I need to make um, pumpkin bread and banana bread and roast the pumpkin seeds from Saturday. They're in the fridge though, so they're fine. And tomorrow I have a doctor's appointment. Tate has a makeup test. What else? What else I got going on? I'm going to run. I'm going to vote. And that's it. I'll maybe take some more videos of the puppy, but I wanted to get back on track. Airbnbs is our silly gratitude. Airbnb is proof that a vast majority of strangers who will invite you into their home are not interested in eating your spleen. These people who had this puppy are so trusting. They didn't, they didn't want much from me at all. I actually gave my number. Oh, I had a huge burp during one of the just dances, but I had just stopped it. You guys would have loved it because I had to die at A and W root beer. Made me burp. All right, you guys, I'm feeling a little better now. I was starting to feel like. A little bit of anxiety today, but I'm okay now. I think I just have a lot with us going on vacation. I'm starting to feel like uh, the pressure of that, like making sure everything's taken care of at home, making sure we're all packed, you know, stuff like that. Um, I know David mentioned that the Packers played yesterday. Yeah, it was terrible apparently, but I was at a Girl Scout meeting, so I didn't watch it. And again, I don't really carry too much of that with me, so. Um, doing pretty good for being fasted. I am about, I'm probably like 24 hours right now. I don't really know what the plan is this week. I don't know if I'll just try to do a five day fast, eat a little something healthy on Saturday. And then once we get down to Orlando and settled, maybe go out to dinner with the family kind of broke out up here. I'm wondering if it's from the puppy, something on the puppy, because he was looking me like crazy yesterday up there. I don't know. Hope I'm not allergic to the puppy dog. I wrote that I had an upset stomach this morning and then a little bit of lightheadedness and nausea. No walk. That's all I got for you guys. Except I'll show you my new puppy doll. <laughs> You're doing so good, Leila. Does he have your toy? 